Hello my friends and welcome to episode 21 of Let's Play Cities Skylines Trinity. Now, just take a look at how nice this is. I just wanna, just wanna stop and look at how both aesthetic and efficient all this is. Oh yes, very nice. I, I have to pat myself on the back. Okay, yes, yeah, so I'll even do it out loud. Ready? That's the sound of me patting myself on the back. I am truly a specimen of mankind. Okay, well, let me think about this for a second. This stuff is going to go over here. And I don't want to work on these rail lines really right now, but I do think that we can at least put, build the um, beginning of it just because I want to be able to work on this area without having to wonder how much room I'm going to need. So that's the idea behind this. Hmm. Now we're going to do this one too. Oh, we can get rid of this. Hmm, 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 hmm. And there we go. And these are going to go over here somewhere. Where? I don't know yet. But the point is, we now know exactly how much room we are going to have here. And I say we use this room to finish up this commercial zone that was begun way back. I don't know how many episodes ago, but it was many. And now it's going to be finished. So that is good. We can also get rid of this stupid power line because any moment now, uh, yeah, there we go. We were underground in our demolition view and that was not what we wanted. Yeah, this is going to be the completion of this. By the way, I probably should check just to be sure, like if I wanted to do something like this or... Yeah, see, it's perfectly fine. In fact, what if we just boop? Yeah, I want to make sure this is at least uh, doable under the current... Uh, under the current... Uh, plan, or the current uh, setup, rather. Yeah, but we're just going to leave it like that because we don't know where these two are going to go yet. But now we can take this, uh, snake it around here at the base of the, um, at the base of the uh, little uh, hill or rise or mole hill or whatever you want to call it. Call it Bob Saget if you want. It's not a bad name for a ground formation, I guess. I don't know where the joke of calling things Bob Saget comes from, but I've seen it pop up in multiple places, and there was a time where I swore that I myself thought of it. I think just like everyone independently thought of Bob Saget at the same time, just because it's a very memorable name and everyone who was alive in the 90s knows and remembers who Bob Saget was so yeah that's the uh, idea here so yep instantly oh no oh it's okay it's okay it's okay oh it was scary for a moment but yeah that definitely wants that and I think we might be able to add a hmm do we want to add a little residential I don't know. Well, okay. I'll give him this. I'll give him like this little wedge. And they can be happy with that for a little while. Okay. <laughs> Okay, there we go. We're going to slap that down here. 
power line, how I hate thee. But we're gonna do that, that. Oh man. If only I was one of those bigger YouTubers who pretty much have people following them, hanging on every word they say, I could get somebody to remix a um, a song about how I hate power lines in this game. Put it over some like a beat and have a, some cool rhythms going, and could be a thing. But here's my hope. Once they start developing, I can get rid of this damn thing. At least part of it. And then I can just finish this up. There we go. We might as well put it on this side too, just because I don't think there's any reason not to. But now we get on to the main point of today, which is I wanted to start working on the highways. That's the really the last big thing we have to do before we can actually begin our downtown. Like I said, this highway will go high up over these two things, will go down to ground level, go along here, it will intersect with this highway, which will go at an elevated rate over here. So that is going to be my goal for today. So, mm, yeah, this power line is going to be, can it go under? To, come on, tell me it can go under. No. Okay, it's going over then. Um, yeah. There. That should be fine. And now we can delete all of this. Because now we have an interesting little wedge right here, you see? And this wedge will feature another pair of exits, or another exit for this highway as it goes around. Hmm. But yeah, I kind of want to keep it on the um, the four, you know, and keep it that way up until we get to the uh, intersection with the big boy over here. But let me think about this. We because we want enough room, but we also don't need that much room. So something like that will work fine. Oh, come on. We were doing pretty well up until here, and then it became stupid. So if I do that... Then we get a better and less bullshit version of what we just had. Good, we can do that over here. And now we have picky ro roads going on. Picky highway construction. And there we have it. You see? It goes right over this. The only thing that might be a minor problem is it is now so high that any ramp is going to have to sort of twist its way down, but I don't really consider that to be a major problem, and we'll see very shortly about that. But yeah, pretty much this is going to go on ground level and go right out of here. So let's... It, I wanted to go down at a pretty slow rate just because it would look better. So one, two, three, 
Sorry, Mr. Road, you're getting blued up. And four. And there we have a gradual descent. And then I presume it will continue on. Actually, you know what? It gets a little steep at the end compared to the rest. So let's actually have it go down way over here. And see that? See that perfection? Very smooth. Okay. We're going to be moving these damn power lines many, many times throughout the construction of this. So, first of all, let's just do this. And by the way, this area, this whole area is going to eventually be like extremely urbanized. So, eventually there will not need to be power lines. But yeah, this power line is tremendously in the way because think of all the highways we're going to have zipping around in this area. And I don't expect to finish this intersection in one video or possibly even two because it is going to be, it is going to be extra to use what I think is modern slang for like really good, you know, like if you call a person extra, you're complimenting them. I think that's how it works. Although, asking me about modern slang is probably one of the last people you want to ask, unless it's some, like, an actual old person. Now, I don't know what happened here. Hmm, you know what? Maybe we'll do it in reverse and then fix it up later. Because I think that will actually um, solve our problems. There we go. Yeah, that has the same smoothness as the last one. Now let's do that. And there we go. So I expect this to go straight. So we're just going to, congratulations, um, road, street. You are now a, um, <laughs> a temporary ending of this highway. Just for a little bit, though. And yeah, I predict that people will be starting to use this to get through pretty much right away. But here's my thought. If we can have an exit come down and spin around, it can hit the spot that we want. Or, you know what? It can just hit, it can just go right here. Would you look at that? And maybe we can, maybe we'll get lucky and go two for two, straight up. Okay, we're not going to be so lucky with the other way, it looks like. But we got, we got uncommonly lucky the first time. Wait. That is a steep ramp, but you know what? It counts. So, yeah, I can live with it. Hmm. I am thinking we will do this and possibly this. And over here, I'm going to have a side street. Because, yeah, this area is going to be very urban. And now we try the other side, which I do believe is going to be a lot more complicated. Now I can do this and have it and reverse it later. Um, hmm. I could always have it sort of spin up from here. I mean, coming down is going to be pretty, pretty easy. 
And as for going up, I think it would actually be better to uh, do it over here. Oh yeah, we're still on halves. Hmm. Yeah, this might be a little bit, a little bit trickier than I had hoped. But I think we can do this. And once we've done that, yeah, there we go. So the way that we're going to connect this is just right here. <laughs> and there. Actually, you know what? There's not going to be anything over here, really. So let's get rid of this segment. And oops. Okay. We're just going to have a little bit of a crazy corner. Hmm. <laughs> I like that. It's a little bit of a one of those oddities you'll see in in some places. And as for here, oh, I almost forgot. We need to actually connect the sand. We'll, we'll cut it out there and hope that that doesn't screw us. Nope, that's fine. And so people can get into here, whoever they choose. We could even have a, there we go. Although that does combine both directions in a way. Hmm. Idea. Yeah, things like this can be a lot of fun. Although if I have this, what's the point of this? So we're going to backtrack a little. And what if... Oh, yep. See, people are already using that. I don't even I don't even know. There we go. And that is how you get that way, and you get that way. And you can go around, you can go here, you can go there. Let's upgrade this. Hmm. We're gonna stick down this thing. All right. Basically, I'm just filling out this area first before we uh, move on to the next thing, as you can plainly see. And let's see here. All right, as long as you have that straight arrow, these two should be uh, joined up. And even if they aren't, not the biggest problem. But you can see the space is very well utilized here. So people can be sneaking on over any which way they want. And that is good. Yep, and people are already using this. A lot of them are using it to get down here, which is more efficient for this area than getting off on that intersection. Yeah, it's quite nice to see. Okay, 
So now that we've got that established, we have to start thinking about this. Because I want this to come over here. Hmm. So we're going to be deleting a lot of things here. Hmm. Build more residential, yes I know. But we have other priorities right now. So you are going to have to chill. This basically needs to come here. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab this. And we are going to smooth out this hill. And we're going to see what we can get here. So if I go if I go there with that and let's peacefully click on this, drag it over to here. Do a little bit of smoothing. Then I can I believe we can replicate the same thing with the other side. There we go. It's not as smooth, but I think we can live with it. Hmm, or can we? Well, you know how I like to like to go. Yes, yeah, it's actually about the same, but I think it's uh, probably going to be as good as we get. Hmm. But I don't mind. I don't mind this to be elevated. I think that's actually okay because who knows what's going to go under it. But yeah, we're going to point it. All right, let's take a look here. Perfect. I like this a lot. And we can keep this going pretty much at that angle. So this is going to be a very angled um, interchange over here. So that's going to be rather exciting. And I have a way I want to do it, which I think should work fine for us. But you know what, let's, uh, well, first of all, we're going to preemptively upgrade this. You see? <laughs> and we are just going to sort of declare this to be a very major avenue. And maybe we'll put an exit to it. Although, with this thing going on, there might not be a whole lot of room. We have to be really careful about people using sh stupid shortcuts. Because you know they will. Actually, we're going to go ahead and bump that all the way back to there. Mm -hmm. And I have no idea whether I can just go right over that, but I hope I can. Hmm. Okay, we're going to have to dig in over here. Hmm. 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 All right. Well, actually, I think a, a small curve is actually in order here. And that will go here. And uh, 
We can do this. Come on, you prick. Okay. Well, there's no way this is going to line up, is there? Oh, we have to do this. Uh, we haven't done all of that yet. Well, let's do that before we do anything else. And... Uh, hmm, well, they kind of have different trajectories, but I think that's actually not a big problem. And let's have this go back. We'll make it go the right way later. Hmm. Okay, well that's good enough for now. We might end up having this be uh, going back. But what we, what we are going to do, nope, tradition must be followed. Dirt roads. <laughs> How about this for an intersection? And one more thing before we call it an episode. Yep. And... There we go. Although it kind of feels weird to be going up to be going down, but... Yep, that's how I get under there. I don't know, though. I don't know. Uh... Oh, we have to be above ground to destroy above ground segments. Okay. That's better. So there we go. That is our little exit. And as you can see, people are already making their way over here to go every which way. But as you can see here, this road is going to go around here. This road is going to go straight. And we are going to have ourselves a party, an intersection making party on the very next episode. So I want to thank you guys for watching so very much, and I will see you guys next time.